The Arctic Drilling Showdown, Oil Companies vs. Environmentalists The Arctic region is one of the last frontiers for oil exploration, with an estimated 90 billion barrels of oil waiting to be discovered. However, drilling for oil in the Arctic poses a significant threat to the environment and wildlife in the region. The battle over Arctic drilling is a contentious issue, with oil companies and environmentalists clashing in the race for resources. In this article, we will explore the history of Arctic drilling, the arguments for and against it, and the current state of the debate. What is Arctic drilling? Arctic drilling refers to the process of searching for and extracting oil and gas resources from the Arctic region. This involves drilling into the seabed and rock formations beneath the icy waters of the Arctic Ocean or onshore in the Arctic tundra. The extraction of these resources is typically done by using specialized drilling equipment, such as drilling rigs and offshore platforms, and requires significant investment in technology and infrastructure. However, Arctic drilling is a highly controversial issue as it poses significant risks to the fragile Arctic ecosystem and wildlife, including the polar bear, walrus, and various species of whales and seals. Why is Arctic drilling controversial? Arctic drilling is a highly controversial issue due to several reasons. Firstly, the Arctic is one of the most fragile and pristine ecosystems on the planet and any disturbance caused by drilling and exploration activities can have severe and long-lasting consequences on the delicate balance of the region. Secondly, the Arctic is home to a unique and diverse range of wildlife, including several endangered and protected species, such as the polar bear and various species of whales and seals. The disturbance caused by drilling can disrupt their habitat and put their survival at risk. Thirdly, the Arctic is also a critical area for climate change research and understanding, as it plays a crucial role in regulating global weather patterns and the Earth's climate. Drilling in the Arctic can contribute to greenhouse gas emissions, exacerbating climate change, and damaging the fragile Arctic environment. Finally, Arctic drilling also raises questions about the balance between economic interests and environmental protection. While oil and gas exploration and extraction can bring significant economic benefits, particularly to Arctic communities, it also poses a significant risk to the environment and the long-term sustainability of the region. These issues have led to a heated debate and clashes between oil companies and environmentalists, with both sides arguing for their interests and priorities. The History of Arctic Drilling Arctic drilling has been a topic of interest for oil companies for over a century. In the early 1900s, the first attempts to explore for oil in the Arctic were made in Alaska, but it wasn't until the 1970s that significant discoveries were made. In 1969, the Santa Barbara oil spill in California led to increased concern about the environmental risks of offshore drilling, which led to a moratorium on drilling in federal waters off the Atlantic and Pacific coasts. However, the moratorium did not apply to the Arctic, and oil exploration continued. In 1981, the Arctic National Wildlife Refuge ANWR, in Alaska was established, and a portion of it was set aside for potential oil and gas exploration. Over the years, Numerous attempts have been made to open up this area to drilling, but environmentalists have been successful in blocking these efforts. In 2017, the Trump administration opened up a portion of the ANWR for drilling, but the Biden administration has since halted these efforts. The arguments for and against Arctic drilling. Proponents of Arctic drilling argue that it will provide economic benefits, create jobs, and reduce the United States' dependence on foreign oil. They also argue that technological advancements have made drilling safer than ever before, and that companies will take every precaution to protect the environment. However, opponents of Arctic drilling argue that the risks outweigh the benefits. 
They point out that the Arctic is one of the most fragile and pristine environments in the world, and any oil spill would have a catastrophic impact on the wildlife and ecosystem. They also argue that the economic benefits of Arctic drilling are overstated, and that the long-term damage to the environment and local communities is not worth the short-term gain. The current state of the debate. The debate over Arctic drilling is ongoing, and both sides are actively lobbying for their positions. Oil companies continue to push for access to Arctic resources, while environmental groups are fighting to protect the region. In addition, the political landscape is constantly changing, with different administrations taking different positions on the issue. In recent years, oil companies have faced setbacks in their efforts to drill in the Arctic. Shell's attempts to drill in the Chukchi Sea in 2015 ended in failure, and the company ultimately abandoned its Arctic drilling program. In addition, numerous banks and financial institutions have pledged not to fund Arctic drilling projects, citing environmental concerns. Conclusion The battle over Arctic drilling is a complex and contentious issue. While oil companies argue that drilling in the Arctic is necessary for economic growth and energy security, environmentalists argue that the risks to the environment and wildlife are too great. The debate is likely to continue for the foreseeable future, and it remains to be seen what the ultimate outcome will be. Thanks for watching.